Now since we're working with tubing, we're going to take measurements center to center. We're going to start in the very center of our first fitting and we're going to measure the distance to the very center line of our end point fitting number two. Uh, we always want to measure from the very central point to the very central point. Now with this, today what we're doing, we're going to just kind of work on we're making a run that goes from here to here and so we're going to have our two fitting points and we're going to come out two inches. This one's going to be two inches also. All right. So now we need to figure the distance between these two. We'll measure like this of this fitting and we're going to measure to the very, very center of that fitting. And what I come up with is about six and a half inches. Six point five inches. Now the bulk measurement for that, if we just take those numbers together, is obviously going to be uh, ten inches of tubing, or ten and a half inches of tubing. However, uh, we don't want to just go ahead and cut a ten and a half inch piece because these corners are not going to end up perfectly square. And square corners actually take up just a little bit more tubing than a rounded corner.